Yo, yo, yo! Welcome, Viv. I'm gonna hand this over to you. We are here. No, why did that shitty music turn on? <laughs> this thing is so con mute. All right. Um, so we are here in our um, Honda Civic, and we are going to self-drive uh, to Best Buy. Um, so let's see. This this turns. This one I need This to one's hard out. for humans, so. Well, this one you have a torque limit problem, yeah. So it's a little upset, but you know. Alright, let's see. Um so Which one do you want to go to? Oh, the best buys? Oh yeah, that one down there. Coma, yeah. Yeah, you want to go Coma? One of these days, you know, once we have the nav integration, it's gonna be a good day. Wow, 41 people already. Exciting. 41 people already. Show them, yeah. show them the wheel, you show them the open pilot. I'm showing open pilot. Um, so this shot. is 0 0.3.3. This is the latest uh, open source release, which has the best model of all the models I've ever seen with open pilot. Um, and it's really thanks to the crowd. It's thanks to, you know, we're now training on all the data from uh, every other user of open pilot. So all the cars make each other smarter. Um, are people asking anything? Always, if people yeah. ask stuff, just ask. read it out to me. So you exciting. Know? Can you I buy watch? this? Bonjour, Viviane. Bonjour. Bonjour. Uh, can you buy this? No. You don't, it's even better. You don't need to buy it's it. It's free. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we've put the plan. So this is running. This is a common Neo, um, which we have free plans for available on the internet. Or there are uh, third parties which have taken our plans and made them available for sale. Um, this is software is called OpenPilot, and it's 100% free, licensed under the MIT license, and you can just go to our GitHub and download it. So I do need to disengage here because this is a red light, and OpenPilot does not yet support red lights or stop signs. Is this a Neo with uh, Is this a Neo with Panda? No. Uh, this is actually the. There's a Panda inside of this Neo, so yes, it is the Neo with giant Panda. Compatible cars. Um, but it also works with the old Neo board. Uh, yeah. Compatible cars right now are the Honda Civic, the Acura ILX, the newest edition, the Honda CRV, mm -hmm. and soon, once we get it upstreamed, the Chevy Volt. Mm -hmm. um, so I did have to disengage for this red light. Does here. it work in traffic? Yes, it yes, does. Yes, it works in traffic. Um, if you saw, it was just working in traffic. So let's wait for this light to turn green. I'll get us up to speed and then we will re -engage. Will you ever make a video tutorial on how to port cars? Maybe. So if you saw my last Periscope stream, we, uh, yeah, and that's good that you're holding it too. Try to not cover the antenna. Yeah, exactly. Remember antenna gate? Yeah, yeah. Um, if you watch my last stream, I show off the initial stuff we do for the Prius, uh, which shows you how to maybe connect a new car. Oh, we're going to get another disengagement up here probably, unless this light magically turns green. Um, so it will work as long as you're not the first car at the light. Uh, it works at lights, but you know we're not the first car at the light, so I'm going to have to manually disengage it for this red light up here. Uh, just like Tesla Autopilot, Volvo Drive Pilot, every shipping system today. There's not a single shipping system today which will uh, stop for red lights. But red lights are not really that hard, and you know we don't just make Open Pilot. We also make a dash cam app called Schiffer. Uh, we use the Schiffer data to not just train the self-driving cars, but also to make maps. Now, the trick when you're making maps isn't just to know what intersection the lights are at, but it's important to also know exactly where the light is that corresponds to the place that you stop. Talk about more about... Viv, you're chewing gum on the periscope. Shoot, you're right. Yeah, oh, come on. Would Casey, so would Casey nice that chew gum? Oh, that's so nice. Would Casey nice that do chew gum on his Do I need to modify hardware? Can I do this in a least brand new Civic? You can do it in a least brand new Civic. It's super easy. You just need to unplug one wire and plug it into our thing. And then when you want to switch it back, you can, uh, you know, just switch it back. Why are red lights hard and when do we think we'll support them? Red lights are not that hard and we will see certainly moves in that direction this year. When will maps be integrated into OpenPilot? Oh, uh, yeah, we'll, we're, we'll, we'll be moving in this direction uh, this year as well. A little hard on the brakes there. The reason it was a little bit hard on the brakes there is because uh, the radar by default filters out uh, stopped cars. 
but when it fuses with the vision system, it can stop for car stop cars. So that was a fully stopped car. It's kind of hard for the radar to see and hard for the radar to distinguish from, say, like a manhole cover. Um, you can point it at me. You can point it at what me. model types of Civic? Um, anything with Honda sensing. Radar or LiDAR? Uh, so it uses the built-in radar from the car. Obviously, there's no LiDAR. Uh, LiDAR is overpriced. Someone's, yeah, cool. Uh... There's not that much that a LiDAR really helps you with as part of the driving problem that you can't do today using uh, modern deep learning and computer vision with cameras. People are asking for when will level 3 autonomy be available? Well, you know, when the statistics show it's ready. Um, so I would expect it first from Tesla, slowly followed up by us. So let's see how it does here. Look at, take a look at the lines on the road. They're very confusing. Um, so steer control saturated is when we've exceeded the uh, steering torque limit of the car. Um, the torque limit is a safety feature uh, put there by Honda, not by us, to prevent any sort of these systems from jamming the wheel super hard. So I'm just going to put the speed up here manually to 65. Um, yeah, once we do maps, we'll integrate uh, the speed limit automatically as well. Yeah, the speed limit's actually only 45, so we'll be going very slow here. Do you support other companies using uh, absolutely, yeah. OpenPilot is open source under the MIT license. So do we support them? Do we give them support? No, but can they do it? Of course, yeah. The license says so. Yeah, we, I mean, we encourage it. Yeah. We're currently in the Civic. We are currently in the Civic. I'm getting off of it. Oh, I have it here. Oh, shoot. I should be sending Now, this. one of these days, the Neo will tell you this stuff, too. Um, Saramonti Boulevard. All right. When does Honda come out with self-driving cars? <laughs> <laughs> Jokes, when, man. When will you Jokes. be able to override the Honda torque preventer? We already can, but for safety reasons, we don't. A little wobble there. With that, we'll go. Yeah. Thoughts on Mobileye? You know, they got acquired for a lot of money. They're not the worst. They're not the worst. There's 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 much worse people out there than Mobileye. Um, you know, the CTO really did start to change his tune about self-driving. Uh, I think they were took a ridiculous position on the Tesla thing. Uh, you know. uh, why is ours better than Tesla's system? Why is ours better than yeah. Tesla's system? Uh, because you can put it in your twenty thousand dollar car. Yeah. Tesla system. You know, what's it seventy thousand? What does the Panda do? What does the Panda do? Well. The Panda is the uh, universal car interface. So the Panda basically allows computers, like the Neo, or like a computer, or like your smartphone, to plug into your car. So the Panda basically allows full access to your car over either USB or Wi-Fi. Just keep driving for a bit so we can keep talking. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, what's our company name? We're Comma.ai. We are Comma.ai. Uh, and actually, we are doing our, oh, I almost forgot, our, we're, we're launching our first product uh, for sale this Friday. Um, so we, we announced this on our Twitter, uh, first product for sale this Friday. Um, we're open to press Wednesday and Thursday by appointment only. How will we be able to override if we can't, how will we be able to advance if we can't override the actuators? Well, we can, just not yet, all in time, right? Price. Free. Sort uh, of. Open Pilot is open free. Pilot. The product, the product price has obviously not been announced yet because yeah. the product hasn't been announced yet, but it will be for sale um, on Friday. Point two. Oh, this is your. Yeah, I know. Oh, I know. We, we are well, keep driving oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. for a little bit, you know. What is the end goal for a kit like this to cost in the future? Um. Well, the entry level stuff should be under a thousand. Then if you want fancier stuff, maybe we'll keep it under 5000 Would there be a subscription fee? Uh, very possibly, yes. Not yet. No subscription fees yet. And OpenPilot will always be free. It's not like we're ever going to start charging for, for the current version of OpenPilot. It's kind of keeping their Civic. We love our Civic. We do love our Civic. We did just buy a Prius, though. We love our Prius, too. But uh, we love our Civic as well. So we've been self-driving now for about four minutes. You can see that's the bar right there. Um... 
When that bar runs out, the system makes sure that you're paying attention by forcing a user action to happen every uh, six minutes. If that bar runs out, the thing will beep and ask you to take, uh, take control back. Which can also happen for several other reasons, if it like hits a torque limit or... You know. People are asking us to locate a 17 volt, we will be doing that. Could this work on old cars without radar? Without radar, potentially, we'll offer a camera-only solution in open pilot. Um, without the actuators, no. You need you need the car to be able to turn the wheel, hit the brakes, hit the gas automatically. Will you launch a product like sensors for cars which does not have sensors? Yeah, I mean that's sort of what it is. The Neo, the Neo is the sensors. Uh, we again, we don't we don't sell the Neo. Um, how, how does insurance coverage work with self-driving? Well, so right now these are level two systems. Um, so Tesla's shown that level two systems make driving slightly safer when used in conjunction with a person. So you are, I'm still the legal operator of this vehicle. Um, hi, I'm the legal operator of this vehicle, um, even though it's in uh, self-driving mode right now. And if someone has a car that does not have a radar, can they buy a radar and then have it be compatible with the pilot? Yes, they can. Um, so you can buy, we recommend the Delphi ESR 2.5. It's a really nice radar. Uh, if you want to use the simplest one to get started with is the NIDAC that ships in these Honda. I might, I might. Um, this model feels good. Yeah, I know. Yeah, right? Like, it's no wobble. This is, this is a big improvement. Will the 2010 Prius work with LKA? Uh, if you have a Prius with LKA, maybe. LKA and ACC to really be supported. Uh, but the Prius in particular, because it's a hybrid, hybrids usually have brakes that are more actuatable. So you're going to see what happens right now when the health bar runs out. It's going to start beeping and it's going to ask me to take back control. Sunset in that phone. That looks nice. Beautiful, right? Does your product work in bad traffic? Good on yes. gas. Product works in traffic and it's excellent on gas, like most cruise control systems. Way better than you. Way better than you. Save the environment. Save the environment. And look, the health bar is really about to run out right now, so let's say I'm not paying any yep. attention. Not you know? paying attention. I'm not look paying attention. I'm letting the car take drive control. up, take control to regain speed, and eventually the car will start to uh, slow down. Yeah. But I'm going to take control back. Is 0.33 master version? 0.33 is master version, yeah, it's actually shipped. Um, so I'm just going to re-engage here. Uh, break error! Um, so this is, there we go. this is, uh, no, 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 this is, uh, this is caused by something else. So this probably won't happen in the release version of Open Pilot. This is actually trunk Open Pilot, so I'm going to have to power cycle the car. Um, so I'm just going to get off the next exit quickly power cycle the car and then we'll be back on our way to Best Buy. I'll actually get off the exit this time. Yeah. It's going to be a short periscope, guys. Can you take control at any time? Yes, you yes, absolutely can. Yes, of course you can. Um, if you step on either pedal, the system will immediately disengage and the amount of torque that it's capable of putting on the steering wheel is super small. So if you steer, the system doesn't disengage, but you can override how much it's turning the wheel with one pinky. What if you don't take control after the alert? It slows down. It slows down. Yeah, it stops accelerating. We'll continue to steer, but it stops accelerating. And soon we will probably have support uh, if you have the right connection to turn your hazard lights on when this happens. Just like GM Super. Put in neutral and restart. <laughs> Put in neutral and restart. That's a little uh, a little risky. Ballsy, you know. Especially on Periscope. This this stuff. Yeah, stays right, with you. right. Periscope's forever, you guys. Will there be shops offering installation and setup? Oh, I don't know. Do you own a shop? Yeah. Do you own a shop? Accord support. Accord support is almost done. Um, I think we have to go there. All right, I'll pull into this bro's driveway. We do not endorse we do or not endorse affiliated this. with this guy. Nope. Nope. All right, so we're just going to power cycle. Yeah, so this happens when things lag a little bit. So I'm going to go home and I'm going to review this event. Um, like I said, this actually isn't 0.3.3. Um, this is an internal version of OpenPilot, uh, which probably has this bug. So it's called Will a uh, regression for a reasonable Cydia. Yeah. <laughs> but the, the iPhone jailbroken app store. Um, so common AI kits are based on Android. Um, so, no. <laughs> uh, what is estimated installation, install, and setup? Oh, the time? Yeah. Super fast. 
super fast. So like I said, it's really one connector. I'll show you guys when we pull into the Best Buy parking lot just how easy it is. All right, let's get back on the highway here. Silky smooth. Uh, this is not running silky smooth. Uh, silky smooth is very beta right now. You know, we're a little bit behind Tesla in that way. But um, yeah, it should be able to get us on the highway here. I'm gonna have to do the lane changes. Um, so OpenPilot itself can do lane changes, but the reason we don't support it is because we don't have a safe way of knowing whether your blind spot is clear. Uh, the phone only has one forward-facing camera. So I'm gonna have to disengage and do these lane changes manually. Our website is comma.ai for that question. And what's on the Best Buy shopping list? What is oh, on the Best Buy the shopping Best list? Oh, the Best Buy shopping list. Well, so let's just say the press is coming by on, um, uh, Wednesday and Thursday, so we're getting them uh, party favors. Is that what you buy the press? Yeah. No, nothing like that. Someone's asking for a reverse mirror by law. Is that required by law? Uh, no. So the law for most states just states that you have to have uh, two mirrors that can see behind the vehicle. And I have them. They're called my left mirror and my right mirror. Oh, if you've already found the blind spot messages, well, um, let's talk. <laughs> Do we have any direct competitors? Not really, no. I mean, I figure we'll start to see them soon once everyone figures out how awesome this idea is. But, um, so I'm getting off Saramonte Boulevard? Like with You're all the, getting with all the off car dealerships? now 47. 47, all right, cool. Yeah. We'll get them in 47. I will show you guys in the parking lot. How do we um, know what cars have actuators that are compatible? How do you know? Well, right now, if your car has lane keep assist and adaptive cruise control, it's a good bet that it's compatible. Um, this is actually the hardest time of day for, for Open Pilot too, because the sun is so low in the sky. You can see it's doing pretty well. Uh, people think nighttime is hard. Nighttime is actually easier than daytime, uh, because there's so much contrast between the lane lines and everything else. Now the machine learning has to work real hard. Do we think kids are a short-term business and solve cars in the future with self driving? Um, yeah, I mean, eventually, you know, think about think about like a serious satellite radio, right? It used to be that you would buy a radio and put it in your car. Then it just started to get included with all the cars. Some of them by the manufacturer, but some of them at the dealership. So the path forward for Kama, uh, working with car manufacturers is impossible. These companies are dinosaurs. Uh, but working with dealerships is a whole lot more possible. So we expect that a lot of cars you buy will have self-drive capabilities pre-installed, but maybe not um, from the manufacturer. Getting a lot of good shots. You know, they're not. You know, know, they know I'm not doing anything, right? Oh, they know exactly you're not doing All right, anything. Good. Yeah. I mean, this is a self-driving car. You know, we're not just periscoping me shit talking. Put your feet higher up so we can get <laughs> that. There we go. There we go. Um, so you can see, yeah, you can see what the. Uh, so we're set at 70 miles an hour now. We're going 48 because this brosky in front of me is slow. Are you gonna work on left right turns using the 2017 Prius and Sinus Park Assist? Mm, yes, we are. Detect stop signs and speed limits? Oh, we don't have to detect uh, speed limits or stop signs. You know where they are, right? So as long as you know where the car is, you know what to do. Uh, red lights, you have to just detect whether they're red or green, not necessarily where they are. Ever thought of taking the Mobileye approach and licensing? No, Mobileye seems more concerned with how many units they sell and less concerned with the quality of those units. I'm a lot more concerned with the quality of the units. Is this the exit? 1.2 miles. Stoked. Um, so yeah, I mean, we're fine with sort of, the, the way it is, like, say Toyota wanted to put this in their cars, or say we're in a Honda, say Honda wanted to put this in their cars, we'd be happy to give it to Honda under the same terms we'd give it to any individual. Which is right now, if Honda would like to use this, it's free. Honda could literally ship their cars with this stuff for free, and it's way better than their system. All right, so we're going to do a lane change here without disengaging, and I'll show you what it does. So I have my blinker on, I'm just going to turn, and then I'm going to let go of the wheel here. It's going to pull me right back into the lane. What do you do with the shiffer data? Um, we make maps and train the self-driving car. Are you the creator? Yep. I am. Sure. Yeah. Well, we have a cut in here. We have a CRV. Honda system is indeed garbage. The Honda system is indeed garbage. Which means 
this is the John Daly Boulevard? Uh, oh, did I miss East the Moore exit? Avenue. No, it's this one. Oh, it's this one. All right, all right, Eastmore. All right, cool. Let's go that way, car. When will you have auto lane change like Tesla? Um, as soon as we're in cars that have the right sensor. So Tesla's using the ultrasonics for that, which is a little bit sketchy. Um, but for example, the Prius has side radars. Are there voice commands? Not yet, but maybe someday. So this turn's going to be... Well, no, it's doing it. It's doing it. It's doing take it. a look. look take a look. It's going. <laughs> Uh, we actually shipped uh, a 6% increase to torque um, in the uh, in the latest version. Um, so yeah, open pilot, you know, it's for a little bit more than highways. It's obviously very good at highways. But, um, you know, for this kind of stuff, am I going south or north? Uh, you are going Junipero. Oh, I'm going Junipero. All right, yeah. all right, we're really getting over there, I say. Yeah, the limit is six minutes before it runs out. Pretty soon. Oh, wait, knows we want to go there. Nice. Not really. Not got it. <laughs> this turn is well beyond what it can do. Yeah, well that beyond. turn was probably actually meant to be taken at a little slower speed. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so on roads like this, we can re-engage. Yeah. Yeah, best part is far. <laughs> best part is not that far. We drove a little bit extra for the uh, for the good folks on the uh, Periscope. Yeah, I mean, soon, maybe even before we ship red lights and stop signs, we'll ship uh, navigation built into Open Pilot, um, so you'll be able to type in your destination. And even if it can't make the turn, it will tell you which turn you need to take. Um, it will be able to make some turns. When there's like a fork in the road, it'll be able to choose. Can GANs be used to generate driving data, reducing the need to mm -hmm. something? Mm -hmm. Can GANs? You want to use GANs? You a GAN expert? You want to come work here and build me some good GANs? Is this where it is, by the Yep, you're right. Oh, you're Best Buy, there we go. Yo, you want to get some Whoppers at BK? Oh, love Whoppers. Let's get Whoppers, Love man. BK. All right, we do well at Best Buy, we get some Whoppers. Do you still use the CNN architecture that you published on GitHub last year? No, we never used that architecture. Never. That was that was just some research code um, done by an intern. Our architecture is not public, um, but you can reverse engineer the Vision D binary we ship with OpenPilot and you can figure it out. This is me driving, so let's yeah. wait till, let's, yeah, yeah, the system's the well, yeah, What's the minimum speed for open pilot to work? Will it work in stop and go traffic? Yes, of course. Uh, if you have a supported car, which right now is only the Honda Civic, so that turn is beyond. Yeah, beyond do. it. But we'll work in this. Um, it's going. Yeah, so the Civic supports stop and go, the... It's, it's just a limitation of how you control the gas on the car. So our ILX actually supports stop and go, even though it doesn't by the manufacturer, because we built a gas pedal interceptor, and maybe we'll release instructions about how to do that. Single the code's already in open file. Single lane support, they're asking? What do you mean single lane? I'm not sure. If you're on like a one lane I road? I so. It'll work, yeah. Yeah. Who knows what to do? Wow, the most people came on when we're getting oh, Best Buy. People actually care about Best Buy. Yeah, you know? people care about Best Buy. You want to live stream Best Buy too? People have asked that. <laughs> if we can live stream Best Buy? <laughs> Wait, install parking. All right, I don't know what an install is, but I'm definitely not doing it. Can it make slow turns? Uh, mm -hmm. Can it make slow turns? Yeah, I mean, it can't make, it can't put a lot of torque on the wheel. So if you got to like really turn the wheel, basically anything you can do with a finger, it can do. Where are we? Single lane markings, not single lane. Oh yeah, of course. Yeah. It doesn't need both lanes. It's one is fine. Show us how to shop, George. Show you how to shop. Should we live stream Best Buy? <laughs> Do they allow that? <laughs> Best Buy's not gonna stop me. All right, all right, all right. Let's let's. Do we have people? We have eighty-one people. All right, all right. Let's live stream Best Buy. Let's see if we start to get a lot of drop off. We'll uh, we'll leave. But all right. So I'll reveal what we're doing. We're gonna buy some <laughs> uh, big screen televisions to show off our analytics. Uh, to the press. Um, we have some awesome analytics now. We have like big maps of uh, where all our users are and stuff. So we're going to show this all off to the press um, when they come by Wednesday or Thursday for our product launch, which will be available for sale on Friday. Um, be sure to follow us on Twitter if you're interested in this stuff. All right, I'll just show you a little bit about how installation works, right? So on this Civic, I removed the rearview mirror. I can't encourage you to do this because the rearview mirror is considered a safety feature of your car. Um, so we actually encourage people now to use a GoPro mount and mount it underneath. But if you do individually decide to do this, uh, we believe it is legal, um, but you know, I'm not a lawyer. Uh, so this is a Neo. Um, so you can see this is running base UI here. Should be able. No, it's not going to work. Um, 
Yeah, this is a, this is an internal internal build, not as good as the external builds that we actually uh, ship. No, I, no, this will work. This is just really slow. Um, so these are like all my previous drives, so I can go through and I can see them on here. Let's see what they look like. Um, so this is a little slow because we're actually restricting this app to one core um, because we leave the rest of the cores available for the self-driving system. But now that it's clearly not self-driving, it should be able to use more. Um, so I can kind of, you know, pan through my route here. And this is all in the cloud, so you don't have to worry about storage space on the device. You can see the little car icon is no, because we're not connected to a car. But, um, yeah, so this was a drive. It looks like someone went to the airport. Um, I don't always drive this car. This car is available to our employees. Uh, so, yeah. We have um, 108 people. They're going to be confused. They, they think oh, we're self-driving. that we're going to Best Buy. We really were self-driving. We really were self-driving. You all missed it. I don't think we should show them Best Buy. We won't show them Best Buy. We'll, we'll come back we'll on come the way back home. We'll come back on the way home and periscope that, too? Yeah. Yeah, maybe yeah, we'll yeah, show yeah, them we'll, what we bought. Yeah, yeah, we'll show them what we yeah, bought. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, 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 it's exhausting. I love Best Buy, and yeah. I, don't, I can't show off all my enthusiasm yeah, on Periscope. Yeah, it's going to be too much. Exactly. Well, well, let's, go, let's go through this first. Yeah. And so this is a common Neo. Um, we built it. Uh, the instructions are available uh, for free at our GitHub, github.com slash comma AI. Um, also, you can buy them from two third parties have sprung up and set up little Neo sale shops. Um, they usually include this cable which goes from this RJ45, it's not Ethernet, it has two CAN buses on it and power, to this JAE connector, which is how you plug into the Honda, right? So if this was a new car, it would have a rear view mirror, it would have a little cover here, you just pop off this cover. This plug is usually plugged in to this thing here. So this is the stock self-driving system in the Honda. You know, some people say that, oh, well, your thing only supports the same stuff as the stock. Here's what I encourage you to do. Buy a Honda, try the stock, and if you're happy with that, you don't need our stuff. Um, but this is this is the little stock system here. You see there's like a little cute camera. It's got a Xilinx Zinc FPGA inside of it. We used to call it the Mobile Eye. It actually did not have a Mobile Eye chip in it. Um, so we shouldn't, uh, what's the word? Libelize Mobile Eye? Libelize, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mobile Eye, they're right. They're, they're, you know, hey, they got acquired for a lot of money. If that was their goal, then, you know, judge people by their own goals. Um, so yeah, this is the stock uh, system, and you see that our thing has the same connector as the stock system. So I'm going to put that back in there. You don't even have to remove it. You can just leave it. Unplug this one wire. Plug this one wire into here. Take this wire. Plug it into your Neo. Remove your rearview mirror. That's done with one screw, uh, but I can't tell you to do that. Um, and then just slide this on like this, and you are good for self-driving. Um, what are they saying? They're I love, saying... I love when you read this stuff oh, to me. They're saying a lot. It's hard to keep they're up. They're saying a lot. Yeah. I'm going to have to rewatch. this. Where can we get connectors this? for different types of cars? Oh, connectors for different types of cars. So this is a JE connector we bought off of DigiKey. Um, you can find other connectors on DigiKey. Yeah, people want to know where we get the where would they get the equipment. Uh, what equipment? They're saying where do we get all the equipment. All oh, like this, this thing? Yeah. So the plans for this are available on our GitHub. Uh, you can also buy them from a few third parties. Um... But a lot of it you got to make. Yeah. You know, this is still this is still all very early. We were talking about selling a product last year. We announced it, but then uh, you know, for for regulatory reasons and for you know, we just couldn't provide a true consumer product. So we're like, let's go the hobbyist route. It's kind of like Oculus. Let's ship some things that are a whole lot more like development kits, and then let's work up to an eventual consumer product. You know, the kind of thing soccer moms can use. Nice. Okay, um, we will be back. We will be. We'll be back. Do not we'll be, leave. We'll, we'll be, be back. Be quick we'll be, Best Buy. Well, we won't be that quick. I love Best Buy. We love Best Buy. Oh, and Whoppers. And Whoppers. <laughs> we can, Should we live stream the we Whoppers? We can live stream Whoppers. And no, then we'll, 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 we'll live stream watch. eating a Whopper yeah. while the car drives us Don't home. Don't be disappointed if you join. If you join when we parked. You will see a self-driving. You 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 will, experience. or you can just go back and you can see. Or you can go back. You can go back. Yeah. All right. Ninety-seven. We were doing so all right, well. All right. All right. Cool. All right. Bye, folks. All right. Bye. Bye.